Hi guys, M0 NMC here, coming from you, coming at you from the Chaos Channel. Um, I had a small problem uh, with my QO100 setup not long ago, where I was uh, installing the latest version of SDR console, uh, which will give you the nice um, markers for the band for the uh, for the entire bandwidth of the QO100 satellite. If I just show you the old version. Uh, there we go. Hang on. There. Right, as you can see here, we've got um, all the old markers up here. And, uh, yeah, they're all right, functional, and they tell you everything you need to know. But the new version is much nicer. However, when I went to install mine, I installed it over the top, and then I'd completely lost all... The signal coming down. I thought, oh goodness me, what on earth's going on here? I uh, thought it was, might be the cable. Thought it might be the LNB. It's not the first time I've had problems with things like that. And then, so I went on to the QO100 Facebook group, which I'm an admin of. Um, silly mistake this is, but anyway, I got some uh, very good and quick replies about one thing. You have to remember to put in the down converter. <laughs> So what I'll do is I'll just flip back to the um, screen there. Um, and if I go to... Just close that a minute. Okay. Okay, so if we get rid of the old SDR consoles, so the first thing you do is chuck in there. Go to here. This is the download procedure first. So go to the main program here and then go down and then click on that button, download straight down to the bottom ding, 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 ding. and there and then you can go there so it's 32 bit or 64 bit whichever version you need click on microsoft i always do it's easier and then download it there and wallop there it goes so we'll just delete that because i don't need it anyway oh, it's still downloading don't want it go away <laughs> all right i'll let it download whatever anyway you install that and then, once it's installed, you start up your program. Choose your, uh, whichever one you're using, which my one is the uh, Pluto SDR through the local area network. But make sure that you have your down converter selected, which I forgot to do. And then click start. And everything will suddenly work. It's amazing. Look at that. So, like, you should be able to hear it all now. It's a bit of a overkill with the colour. For some reason, it's reset itself there. So we'll just put on the geostationary beacon lock. It's a bit off. Gotcha. There we go. Right, so then just wind that up to 750, and you should, we should have it. I don't know if the sound is... Uh, the sound's not overpowering anyway, so that's a little bit off, so let's just take that back down there. And, like, as you can see, it's quite a bit off there. Now, I did change the settings on this, for some reason, it's not where I left it. So if we just bring it down, 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 down. Zoom that out for some reason. Everything's changed. I don't know what's going on here. Was, oh, hang on. I've got USB selected. That doesn't help. Uh, so I've got um, CW selected. There we go. So we go the other way. And there it is. Mine's always set to negative 1.5. No idea why, but it is. So there we go. We can go into a state. I'll just put the old headphones on so I can actually hear what I'm doing here. Got a station here. Yeah, Roger, Roger. I mean, no problem. I count the time. I'm the uh, 60 years. And that's working a treat. So... Basically, the problem is, is do not forget to select a down converter. Otherwise, you'll be scratching your head going, 
oh my goodness, what have I done now? Which is exactly what I was doing for about 12 hours until I figured out <laughs> what I'd done wrong. Anyway, uh, let's press the right button here. Anyway, I really hope that uh, little short video will help anybody who runs into that problem. This new software is very, very good, as you can see. Like you've got your nice um, band markers there showing you where everything should be. Keeps everything where it should be. But once again, it's a lovely upgrade to an excellent piece of software. And uh, there's plenty going on on here at the moment. There we go, see? Anyway, so I hope it helped you. Please like and subscribe. Give the, um, you know, click those buttons for me. It really helps. I know I haven't been putting up very many videos, but I've been a lot, uh, haven't been doing too well recently. And then I've been busy with other things, but there will be more, you know, just bits and pieces. Catch you later. Bye bye for now. From M0 and MC73.